<laughs> He's watching snooker with me, but he doesn't like it. He's not interested in snooker. In the background is playing the Shanghai Masters, and it's now really early in the morning. That's why I'm still in my comfortable clothing and even wearing panda pants. So I'm a little panda. Okay, I have. I'm bored out of my mind. I'm stuck with the Dutch commentary on Eurosport. They are lacking explanation and analysis of the game. I just don't really like watching or listening the um, Dutch commentary. But then again, there's not much to say about snooker. Be honest, snooker is boring and I'm bored. So I have come up with um, uh, a thing to occupy myself and that's playing apps and then I thought well would there be any snooker apps available so let's see I have found look at my owl it's it's four o'clock so it's not really morning anymore but it's for me it's morning I'm having a free day or I'm having a day off so it's four o'clock is morning for me okay so if you if you are uh, it's in a mirror view you hear I have found two snooker apps. Let's click on them. You have Champions and you have Snooker Light. So first I like this one, the Snooker the Champions one. Look at this. World Snooker Champions. So you can select a year. So while shall we start with my birth year? Okay, guess what my birth year is. Whoa! It's 85. I'm dead old. And then here at the bottom you see Dennis Taylor beats Steve Davis with 18-17. And you, it's so handy, like in 2002, if you're in the pub and you say, someone is saying to you, hmm, who won back in 2002? And then you, you put out your app and you hold it under, under the table so they don't see it, of course. And then you say, yeah, yeah I know, Peter Epton beat Stephen Henry back in 2002. Let's find another one. Back in 1975, Ray Reardon beat Eddie Charlton. Oh, don't you think that's so handy? I think that is good knowledge to know. Okay, and if when you're bored with that, you can go back to the second app that I found, and that is the Snooker Light. It's, it's taking a while to Ooh, look at that. You can play snooker yourself. How does it work? Oh. Is it crashing? Oh, no, it's not. Look, basically, you have a snooker table, and then with your finger, you can, um, you, the, the white ball, you can try to shoot, and you have arrows where you can point. So I'm just pointing, like, right there. And did I win? Did I? Oh, where's the white ball? Oh, it's here. Did I score anything? Oh, yeah. I already got two points. Wow. Um, what I like about this app is the sound of the snooker balls. That's really, it, it's a nice realistic sound. But other than that, it's just really hard and you never score much and it takes you forever to clear the table like 10 to 15 minutes at least I <laughs> I was but um, when you're watching the snooker uh, Shanghai Masters early in the morning and you just have to wake up a little bit then it's then it's really good fun yeah oh look at that someone is tired I don't know if you can see it, but he is sleeping. He has his eyes shut. Sunny! Hey! Hello! Wakey, wakey, baby! He's not interested in snooker. <laughs> no, he's not. Ah. Okay, in the background, a baby, if you like to see, is um, who is playing. It is Ryan Day against Lou. There are cookies! Whee! And um, Ryan Day is winning. Of course he is. Where is the lightning gone? Is oh, here he 